I will be explaining it on the base of the two mnemonics. So the first mnemonic is big cartilage are basically flas plastic. Okay. So let me explain this mnemonic and then we will go through this. So as you guys can see the uh, first cartilage, second, third and fourth and fifth cartilage. Okay. So the mnemonic here is big cartilage are basically plastic. Okay. So from this big you see this big you will remember bone. Okay. Now another there is O and E and in the bone you will also see this O and E. So this is also this is how you will also remember from one this is one okay in bone there is one and another one is tendon. So one and O and is in the bone and tendon and this is how you will remember it okay and also from the big you will also remember it. This is cartilage so two is cartilage or cartilage okay so this is how you will also remember it. And from this R, if you invert this A, it will become V. So it means blood vessels. Blood vessels. And from this R, you will say reticulin. Okay. And from this three, you will also remember uterus. Okay. This is uterus. So you will pronounce, pronounce it like uterus. And in the uterus, in the uterus, there is fetus. So from this uterus we will also remember fetal tissue. So the, the, the third one is the, the third one collagen is present in the blood vessels, the reticulins and uterus. So you will pronounce it like uterus and the, in the uterus we have fetal tissue so fetal. And the four is like so from here you see the basically and uh, this four is also for uh, floor okay which is the base. So it is like in the basement membrane basement membrane and five one is just remember the placenta so this is the mnemonic for, uh, for one and two this is very simple you will see o and e and on okay let's explain a little bit more so this is type one the location for type one is if you want to remember more just say one tin on the face of skin okay one tin on facial skin so one is per bone T E N O N is for tendon, face is for fascia, and S is for skin. So 110, okay, is on the face. 110 is on the face. Now uh, the functions for the type 1 is it gives us the strength, okay? And the defect in it is called osteogenesis imperfecta. And how you will remember it? Just in the one you see there is O, so osteogenesis. And one can be right like this, so this one is for I. So osteogenesis Im imperfecta. And now the type 2 cart cart cartilage, this just remember cartilage, okay, so this is how you will remember and that it give the strength to the joint, the function is it give strength to the joint and most probably hyaline cartilage and in the joint we, do, we are doing a articular cartilage. So the destruction in this cartilage uh, which is present on the articular surface of the bone, uh, okay, so this is this will be lead to osteoarthritis. Now the type 3, if you write this one 3 like this and this one 3, they will become blood vessels. I already said from this R you will remember, okay, A R E. If you invert this A, it will become vessels, so in the blood vessels. And this one R is par reticular and the uterus is thus just like uterus you will say and the fetal tissue in the uterus we have a fetal tissue. Now it will lead to the defect in it is will lead to ehler danlis syndrome how that will be vascular type 3 and type 4 as you see this is vascular this A if you invert it it's par vessel. Vessels mean vascular so it will be like vascular type 3 and type 4 and there are three words 1, 2, 3 so this is in the type 3. Now uh, the type 4 it is simply in the basement membrane and it will the defect in it will the, the type 3 function is it it lead to uh, it help in healing okay. Now uh, for type 4 just uh, in from the mnemonic we said basically and that is for basement membrane and the defect it will lead to Alford okay Alford syndrome and good faster syndrome. You just uh, instead of this P you will put 4 okay so like Alford and good foster syndrome. Type 5, as I say from the mnemonic plastic, so the location is a placenta. The defect in it will lead to ehler donlis syndrome that is classical type 1 and type 2. And in the ehler donlis syndrome in the type 3 that was, was vascular type 3 and type 4. Okay, as it present in the blood vessels. Hope you guys will remember it. Just remember the mnemonics. Big cartilage are basically.